I am back from vacation and I had better get busy because it was a slow week. Want to know what sold? Stay tuned. Hi everyone, it's Stephanie from Three Queens Resale and if you are new to my channel, thank you so much for joining me and if you are returning, thanks for coming back. It does mean a lot to me as I work on building my resale community here on YouTube. So make sure you subscribe and you hit the like notification and you do all the things, the bell notification, so that uh, we can be friends forever. So for those of you who are new to my channel, I am a full-time reseller. I just started reselling full-time this summer. Previous to that, I was a part-time reseller for three years and a middle school language arts teacher. I have decided to take a year off from teaching and work on pursuing resale full-time and some other projects that I am working on. So I'm going to get into what sold this week. Full disclosure, not a lot. I have been on a cruise. Um, I was gone for a week, then I was home working on some other things, and then I was gone again this past weekend. But I am back for a whole month. I go to Vegas the end of September. So hopefully we can bang out four strong weeks of of what sold videos starting next week. Because this was not a good week. But we'll get into what sold. So starting off this week goes from Sunday, August 1st through... Saturday, August 7th. So starting off, I did sell a bundle on August 1st, but I had to cancel it because I could not find one of the items that she wanted. And so um, that was a $30 hit right off the start for the week. So yeah, that sucked. So then moving on, on Poshmark, I sold this Tommy Bahama cream long sleeve. Um, shirt size extra large. It was my top that I no longer wore. It sold for $15 and after the $3 in fees I was left with 12 It was item 982 so I've been tracking how many items I list this year. So um, it was my 982nd listing and it had been listed since June. Also, on Sunday, I had my first ever Facebook Marketplace sale. So, whoo -hoo, whoo -hoo. first ever sale. It was this Alfini um, tunic dress size extra large. It sold for $17.50. That was with a 20% discount. Um, after the $0.88 cents in fees and the $5.50 shipping, um, I was left with $11.12 making my Sunday total a whopping $23.12 for those two items. Moving on to Monday, August 2nd, first off was this Madewell um, midi dress, size medium. It sold within a day of listing. Um, it sold for $40, and after the $5.20 in fees, I was left with $34.80, and that had actually um, been in stock since June. I just hadn't gotten it listed yet. Um, then next was this Champion Quarter Zip Sweatshirt Size Medium. It had been listed since April. It sold for $12 and after the $2.95 in fees, I was left with $9.05, bringing my Monday total to $43.05. Tuesday, August 3rd, I sold on Poshmark this um, airy offline uh, medium gray ribbed top. It sold for $13, and after the $2.95 and the $1.50 shipping discount, I was left with $8.55. And then next was this Free People Oversized Blouse, size extra small. This is one of my consigning errands um, items from her haul. Um, which I'll link up above. There's still some things left. Um, it had been listed since January. It sold for $14 after the $2.95 in fees and the $1.50 shipping discount. I was left with $9.55. And 
And then finally with this Victoria Secret Pink Short Sleeve T-shirt. It had been listed since September. It sold on eBay for $10. And after the $1.30 in fees, I was left with $8.70. Bringing my Tuesday total for those three sales to $26.80. On Wednesday, I had one sale. It was this Lily Pulitzer Blue um, extra large dress. It sold for $30. And after the $6 in fees, I was left with $24. It had been listed since August. And it was item 1,074. Um, on Thursday, August 5th, was a St. John's Bay sweater that sold on eBay for $3. After the $0.39, cents, um, and fees, I made two sixty one. That was my sweater that I just am clearing my closets. It had been listed um, since June. It was item nine nineteen, bringing my Thursday total to a whopping two dollars and sixty one cents. Uh, then Friday, I sold this Charlie B casual top that was new with tags. It had been my daughter's, and she decided. Not for me. Um, when she's she's cleaning out her closets to go to college, and we sold our house and we close on the twenty seventh. So yes, there will be many more of the Weddell's items up for sale. Uh, so that sold for twenty eight dollars, and after the five dollars and sixty cents in fees and the dollar fifty shipping discount, I was left with twenty dollars and ninety cents. Next up on eBay was this Forever 21 Stripe Top. It sold for $4.25 on auction. After the $0.55 cents in fees, I was left with $3.39, bringing my total for Friday to $25.59. And then Saturday, I sold this these um, Brandy Mel Melville Jungle Plaid Pants. They sold for $18.00. After the three dollar and sixty cents in fees, I was left with a dollar fifty, and I'm sorry, and the dollar fifty shipping discount, I was left with twelve ninety, and those are from my consignee Emma's haul. Um, Emma is super tiny. Actually, I only have one thing of Emma's left, so I will not link her haul up there. But um, it is a champion sweatshirt, so maybe I'll pop a picture in here, and you can check it out. And if you want it, buy it on Poshmark, eBay, Macari. It's listed everywhere. <laughs> so, the totals for the week. My weekly total, I'm looking out my window. My desk faces out and it looked like this guy was walking in my driveway. But he's not. He's moving on. Total, $157.07, which is probably my lowest weekly total of the year. Um, I sold 12 items with an average sale price of $13.08. The cost of goods was zero for those items, and I sold one, no, actually two items on consignment, and I did not figure out what the percent was. It was probably a third <laughs> of my items, two-thirds, um, or a third, maybe a fourth, or consignment items, 25%, I would say. So those are my totals for the week. Hopefully, next week's video will be longer, because I will have sold more things. Um, but if you uh, like what sold videos, be sure to hit the like button, subscribe, and follow me on my reseller journey. Until next time, thank you so much for watching. Bye.